Uh, but the problem, okay, yeah, but, 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 but how, though? So this is the big inflatable death run. The entire death run is, well, inflatable. Oh, it's got its own music. Oh, listen, yeah, okay, dude, I'm in. This looks awesome. So I'm assuming these kill us, which is really cool. And I mentioned this in a previous death run. I love the fact that people are starting to use unique things that, that kill you in place of, well, other things that kill you. Okay, I truly didn't think that death runs would get any kind of like massive change, but being able to add like custom models and do things like this made death runs actually crazy as well. If you've been around the channel for a while, you know I love death runs. Death runs have been a big thing for me. Um, I've been loving other maps recently, specifically horror maps. Those are a big one for me right now. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, say that again. I swear. I'm gonna hit you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Uh, gotta wait for it to, like, pass the water. And then I gotta hope that I don't grapple the edge. Because if I do, I'm just gonna die. A little bit of lag. Oh, no. Does this bounce? Oh, that's so cool. Uh, okay. Oh, what the heck? No. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, we have infinite sprint, I think. Yeah, we have infinite sprint. Oh, that's awesome. I mean, they've already done it. But someone could more effectively do... Fall Guys in Fortnite Creative, or at least something similar to it, like their own style of party game. They could do like something like party, or what is it, Fall Guys style map, something like this, like little obstacle courses as mini games, and then do something like kind of like a cross between that and then like Mario Party. Their own unique version of it, you know what I mean? Not like a direct copy, or else Fortnite's gonna be like, uh uh uh, can't publish your map if you copied it. Oh, they these fall. Oh, okay. It's a little glitchy. Which, naturally, things are gonna be a little glitchy in this game because, okay, um, what? Do I just tile jump it? I get- Oh, those are spikes. Good, great. How do I avoid that? Okay, so am I supposed to just let it- I I'm assuming I let it do its thing, which is stupid, by the way. I really- I mean, I get it, but I also don't. I don't even know if I need to jump it, but I don't trust it because it's red, and then we just sneak around these. Super easy. My god. Oh, god. Wait. <laughs> I was about to make a comment like, these look familiar. That's a good one. I love that. Oh, the timing on this is going to be... Oh, no, it's not that bad. Okay, we nailed it. We nailed it. We nailed it. Yeah, 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 yeah. And jump this. And see, that's awesome. That's a really, like, cool, unique level that is only possible because of UEFN. I thought it was back-to-back -back hammers, but it's not. Does it just kill me instantly or does it push me off? I kind of hope it would push me off rather than kill me instantly. So that one's gonna kill me in a second if I'm not fast enough. Okay, I'm just falling behind. Oh my god. This is actually pretty intense, especially when it slightly lags. That's because my computer's pretty bad. Okay, what? Oh, I see. The hammers... No, wait. What? I think I parkour on the hammers. Okay. That's a new one. So the red doesn't kill me. At least in the, this case, it doesn't. I don't... I didn't even- I just didn't even jump. I just, I just- I just- you know, I just didn't even- I don't know if this kills- kills me instantly. It does not, or at least it doesn't because I'm immune. It definitely has a vicious knockback on it, which is, uh, terrifying, but, like, not the worst. Not the worst. We're good. Everything's fine. Uh, one of these again. Uh, but the problem- okay. Yeah, but- but, but, but how, though? I guess I have to wait till the right timing and, like, jump and hope that I just stay on it like that. Exactly like that, in fact. I feel like 90% of my videos recently in creative mode, I've just been me gushing over maps. Like, oh my god, this is so freaking cool. Oh, it's- oh, it turns. Oh, it turns. Oh, which way is it turning? I can't tell, because it's- eh. Okay, now I'm inside of it. Now I'm outside of it. Now I'm on top of it. Now what is- what- so glitchy. Just- just- just spam jump. Oh. I- I- yeah. Okay, just- oh, we don't tease the rim. Hey, look, another map. Oh, a big inflatable FFA. Is it, I'm assuming it's by the same person. That's awesome. This is actually pretty easy. It's uh, <gasps> No, it's not. No, okay. Risking it. No, no. <gasps> I mean, the wall. I just need to actually pay attention. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> no, please. Fucking <laughs> lie. As soon as this one turns back, I think we go for it. Yeah. <laughs> Whoever speed run ran this in the, the highest time, what was it, like four minutes, five minutes? Touch grass. <gasps> no! I didn't get enough momentum, and then I also wouldn't have made it anyways, because for some reason, it just slapped me to the left. I'm such an idiot. 
Oh my god, okay, let's go! We nailed it, dude. See, this already looks like Fall Guys. I think it's definitely supposed to be, like, references, but, like, doing their own unique map, which I think is cool. To be fair, though, if they copied Fall Guys, would... would it, I mean, I guess it's, uh, part... I think it's owned by Epic Games, but I think it's developed by other people. But Epic Games probably has the general say in it, but, like, would Epic Games allow a lawsuit? All I know is these turning platforms are... Turning and, or sorry, the, the turning and moving platforms can be very glitchy with, with this, because it's like, it, it's trying to grab on in its previous area, but since it's constantly moving, it's not sure what to do. Maybe they can do something to, like, tweak that in the future to make, uh, okay, make it slightly better. Whoa, super jump, because of momentum! Okay, I don't want to do that here, because I'll end up dying. Jump on the moving platform and shoot the targets, interesting. This also reminded me, if you guys haven't seen it, I did a Lucky Block death run by, I believe it was by J Duth, and I realized a mistake that I, I had said in that. I was like, oh, if it gives you the item to do the level, then what's the point? It technically does, but also gives you a random item that can that can solve it. Because one of the times I got, I think I got a lever action rifle, and then one time I got a hunting rifle. Please stay up. Dude. Yeah, I realized that because I was like, oh, it, it actually did give me a random item. It actually gave me it in the video, and I just didn't realize. Well, that's a, that's a tight timing. We made it, though. We're good. I'm just gonna make the jump. Okay, so I'm assuming these kill- oh, shit. Oh, they just block me, okay. Oh, and it's just- we don't even need to sprint on this, we just- yeah, just- just normal, like, little- kind of momentum jumps. Okay, easy. So I'm trying to, like, word things, I'm not very good at it. Ooh! These have a unique bounce effect that I don't think anything else has had in this game, which is awesome. Oh, that's so cool! Oh my god. Oh, and land it. Uh oh Oh, I see. I was trying to think of what I'm doing here, and the answer is not that. And it, 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 I, I don't know about this level, man. Okay. It's all timing based. Okay, okay, not that bad. It, it, not that bad, but uh, that was a tough level. Yeah, that was a tough level. I guess that's kind of a good thing. You kind of want tough levels. I think they're getting faster as well per one, so I gotta go faster as I go along. And what was that? Please don't hit me. Okay, we're good. All right. Um, what is happening here? Spinnies? Spinnies. Right? Yeah, definitely spinnies. Definitely spinnies and droppies? Man, how are you gonna do that to me? That should be plenty of time, especially because I just fucked it up. Five minutes? Did, did this map in five minutes, huh? Yeah, yeah, we got this. We got this. Yeah, yeah. The timing's a little loose on this one, which is great. I don't have to, like, perfectly time it, which is fantastic. And I just nailed it. I just absolutely nailed it. Look at that. Play again. That's it. We did the, we did the map. I'm, I mean... That was really fun. That was a really good map. Four minutes and 18 seconds. You are an absolute... Oh, hey, I was about to say, a little disappointed that there's no, like, celebration, but there is. Five minutes and 57 seconds to four minutes, 18 is an animal. It took me literally 19 minutes and 30... Well, I guess technically 19 minutes in general just to, just to beat this map. Oh, my God. If you guys enjoyed this one, leave a like, and I'll see you in the next one.